we're viewing our study of Florida, as I said before, as sort of a microcosm for other coastal communities. I think this is one of the places where we're going to see the effects hit first and hit hardest. But our study, I think, is going to be replicable and extended um, to other coastal communities around the country. was a divergence in um, housing transaction volume between the most exposed and the least exposed areas. And so what I mean by that is the places that are most exposed to sea level rise over the next um, 50 to 100 years um, are already showing signs of a slowdown in their home transaction volume. And this um, slowdown began around 2013, um, but we showed that there didn't um, appear to be an immediate effect on prices. It was only a couple of years later, really 2016, 2017, uh, that you start to see a, a relative decline in prices in these communities. Housing markets are this long-lived, durable asset, and a lot of folks, you know, they list their properties, and if they don't find the price they're looking for, then they stick around. They can wait um, until they get the offer that they'd like to see. And for some folks, um, they're still waiting on the sidelines, hoping to sell their homes, but um, clearly haven't found the price that they're looking for. There's definitely going to be some redistributing and migration happening over the next 50 to 100 years. So we think about um, places that are a bit further inland, the Midwest or, or further Northeast as being likely places to migrate. It's going to be a challenge for a lot of you know, state and local governments to respond to these challenges because in the most severe instances, this is going to represent a, an eroding of their tax values decline. There's not going to be the same willingness among the residents to spend on the necessary um, upgrades, um, modifications, um, and adaptations um, to local infrastructure, to sewage, um, to elevating the roads and things like that. So I think this can present a pretty big challenge for local governments down the road.